New tonight, hate crimes are on the rise in the U.S. And the FBI tells Fox 2 there's been a sharp rise since the start of the Israel-Hamas war. Fox 2's Max Dietnight joins us now. Max, the Bureau has specific advice for people who think they're being targeted. Yeah, Manny, that's right. They put out this hate crimes threat response sheet to help people out who think they may be in a scenario like that. They say we're living in a time where people need to know what to do in these situations. The FBI says hate crimes are on the rise. We are seeing a much a heightened sense of fear in our Jewish communities, our Arab, our Muslim, and our pro-Palestinian communities. So what is a hate crime? The FBI defines it as an attack against a person or property motivated by a federally protected characteristic like race or religion. Greenberg says in the past, hate crimes have most commonly been based on race. That recently changed. But lately, since the conflict that we've seen arise between Hamas and Israel October 7th, we have seen an increase in the crimes either targeting the Jewish or pro-Israeli community as well as those targeting the Arab, Muslim, and pro-Palestinian pro communities. The warning comes amid a wave of investigations into possible hate crimes. Last Friday, Indianapolis police arrested a woman who intentionally drove into what she thought was a Jewish school. In Thousand Oaks, California, police are investigating after a 69-year-old Jewish man died after being struck in the head at a pro-Palestinian rally. This has been going on for a number of years now. It's gotten much, much worse. And last month, a six-year-old Palestinian boy in Illinois was stabbed 26 times and killed by the family's landlord, who said he was upset over the Middle Eastern conflict. He's been charged with two hate crimes and first-degree murder. Greenberg's advice, if you feel threatened, do whatever you can to get away. The goal is to get personally safe and secure as quickly as possible and then to call 911. Now, all of these hate crime threats and how you should respond to them, according to the FBI, are broken down on this hate crime response guide. You can read it in full for yourself on the FBI's website. We'll also have it posted with this story on our website, fox2now.com. Andy.